Howdy, howdy. Playing some Alawi today. Up against a Garen. Trying the new build that's kind of been taking over on Alawi. Uh, Black Cleaver into... I don't know what the name of it is. The like Iceborne Gauntlet. Whatever. Oh, I missed one doing that. Uh, but Black Cleaver into the Iceborne Gauntlet. I picked it into Garen because it's a Garen and he's annoying. And then I lag. I mean, he can keep clearing them. I'm just going to keep replacing it. Okay. Nice little bit of damage. Built up my Kong. Problem is he can just do that and just instantly clear. If he wants to keep giving me free trades, that is fine by me. Especially if he uses his other abilities on the minions, because then he can't use them on my tentacles. That's a really bad one. Alright, so, Alawi, your passive are these tentacles that spawn. Uh, your other abilities interact with them. Uh, my Q is the slam in front of me. Uh, looks like that. W, uh, auto attack, empowered auto attack, auto attack reset. You... Uh, cause nearby tentacles to slam whatever you uh, hit with your W. E, it's uh, a line. If I hit an enemy champion with it, like I almost did there, but if I hit an enemy champion with it, uh, I make a clone of them. Uh, then the damage I deal to the clone, a uh, percentage of it gets dealt back to the main champion. Uh, really strong. I don't know if I got that, but I think I did. Uh, really strong, especially in low elo, because people don't know how to play against Alawi. Because they do stuff like this, where he just leaves. So I'm, I'm up in farm. And already got his TP out of him. So I'm in a pretty strong position right now. I don't have any potions left. But, so that's what you want to be doing if you don't lag, is uh, you hit your E, and then you uh, nearly kill them. You want to have your E in between multiple tentacles. The more it slams, the more damage it does, obviously. Uh, and then... I'm, I'm playing kind of stupid right now. I should not be this far up. Alright. I'm going to back by this. Okay. That's fine. I guess. If he wants to keep me here, I'm fine with it. I am still pretty strong. Doesn't seem like it, but I am. Ooh, that hit. Sweet. So, whenever you kill the clone, uh, that's what happens. They become a vessel. They, I caught, they spawn tentacles, and then they cause nearby tentacles to slam. So it gives you just a lot of free pressure. I think what I'm going to do, if I can get to 1500... I'm going to do what I saw some people doing recently, which is get a tier as well. But that only happens if I can actually get to 1500. Okay. So. Now I'm back. Uh, so yeah, Q. Slam in front of you, deals damage. W is auto attack, causes nearby stuff to slam. 
E is the uh, spirit, and then your R, you jump up in the air, and then you slam down. You create an extra tentacle for every enemy inside your radius, and enemies, well, enemy champion, and the vessel counts as an enemy champion. So if you hit your E and the enemy is nearby, you slam, or you hit your R, that's already two tentacles right there. She's very good in team fights. Uh, yeah. That's some damage, huh, bud? Alright, cool. Uh, wish I had done a little bit more damage before I went for that play. I might have been able to kill him. But, I'll take what I can get. Still really far ahead. I don't know why he's not trying to kill me. He has ult. So one thing that is important to note about Alawi is that even if your tentacles are dying, if they've started the slam, they will slam. So okay, nice flash. But uh, so, like if it starts the animation of it slamming and then he kills the tentacle, it'll still get the slam off. Which is very, very important. But you know what else is important? Just not taking a bunch of damage for free. Alright. Uh-oh. Really? Be cautious. Really, bud. He's, he's already on top of me. Should have been cautious, huh? Yeah, I played that stupid. I should not have stayed up that far for nearly that long. But I did. So, you know, it is what it is. I would love if my Diana would come do anything like clear these. Come gank him. He's going to get a free play. Or, what are you doing, dude? Just walk there. It's that easy, you just had to walk in. Alright. So, die once, and then get a kill. Easy as that. Oh, oh, I just realized we don't actually have a ranged bot laner, so this is going to be fun. Alright, I can nearly one-shot... Uh, all of the minions with a slam, so that's pretty good. Let's see if Anivia uh, leaves. All right, so. That's Alawi for you. He walks in and nearly dies. Thanks for another plate. So I am very, very far ahead of him. The fact that he has tabbies does not bother me at all. I know Udyr is bot, so I don't have to worry about him just walking up here right now. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Hit it. Alright, sweet. So he left the circle, so it still spawns the tentacles around him. And meanwhile, I just keep on smacking him. Uh, my ult's back up in, what, 14 seconds? So I'm not really worried about getting ganked. Because even if he does gank me. Oh. Oh. Nearly had it. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Okay. That was a little bit stupid, but it is what it is. If I didn't get CC'd for a minute, or like, CC, silence. If I hadn't gotten silenced and then CC'd, I could have killed both of them easy. Because all I needed was one uh, auto attack. Just make sure Garen doesn't get anything. That's right. The the more pressure I absorb, the better, because it's going to hit a point where they just can't deal with me anymore. Because that's how Alawi works. Like I'm I'm level eleven. I'm about to get first tower, and there's nothing they can do to stop me. I'm up forty farm. So what what do they do? Just keep sending people top? That's fine by me. Now that I have my black cleaver, I'll just kill all of them. Oh my goodness. I hit those. Just keep on, keep on sending them up here. Okay, all oh, y'all. Oh my goodness. Okay. You tried, bud. You tried. Oh, bro, I don't care. I'll kill him. Got his ignite. Alright, just keep absorbing pressure. That's all I gotta do. So, uh, Black Cleaver. 45 attack damage, 350 health, 30 ability haste. Doing physical damage to a champion applies 5% armor reduction for 6 seconds. For a maximum of 30% armor reduction. So, they don't really have anyone too tanky. He'll have some resistances, but that's not that much to worry about but the dealing physical damage grants three movement speed per stack of carve on them for two seconds so also i've already done 1100 damage with this next up iceborne gauntlet any sheen item is very very good on a Lowy because my w is an auto attack reset so it procs on my w so that's really really good for me Ooh, get a good tentacle sweet I don't know where the uh, Garen went, but I'm guessing that was interesting. Oh, come on. Oh, well. I'm just going to keep pushing top. If they want to roam everywhere else on the map and lose their top tower, that's fine by me. Just absorb pressure all game. Partially because I'm an Alawi and partially because it's top lane. My god is not lost. It is a kick in the pants.
team on my man. You you don't win this. Just going back. Mm. Nah, I'm almost to my Iceborne. How much did he sell for? Oh, I nearly killed the pike. They just keep sending everyone for me though. But by the time I spawn, I'll have this up. Rift mid. Okay. Again, pressure absorber. Bam. Got this done. Now, sterics. Okay, that works. Um, I think I can TP to my tentacles if it's still alive. But I don't really need to. How have they gotten both dragons? Alright, anyways, Sterix next. 400 health, gain 50% base attack damage as bonus attack damage. So my base right now is 123, so gain 62. Because it rounds up 62 attack damage as bonus. Just walk on down here. Help him get dragon. Kind of want to get this. That works, I guess. Oh, Anivia, come here. You don't need mana, dude. Cool. So, uh, now I have a Sheen proc that slows on my auto attacks every two seconds. I'm gonna go ahead and back, get myself a pickaxe. So after using ability, my attack, my next, excuse me. Next attack is enhanced with an additional damage and creates a frost field for two and a half seconds. So slow the enemies around me. Make Garen run for his life right after he TP'd. Careful. Oh no, I missed. There we go. Oh, hit it. Hit it. Hit it. I'm lagging and then hitting everything. Ooh, baby. Allowy. I love this champ. I also have a red buff now. Look at this healing. Nice flash and heal. Nah. I wasn't going to get out of that one. <laughs> Still doing a lot of damage to him though. Oh my goodness. Alright. I guess I could have queued. 
did the uh, 4.5% missing health. Alright. Um, if we get a tower... Actually, I'll just wait for Sterix. But I've already done 500 damage to this. Also, this is giving me health, tenacity, and slow resist, which is really good. 4,000 carve damage. Oh my goodness. Balance champ. Next up. Mm, I don't really know what I want to go next. I might go like a death dance. Thorn mail, something like that. Just so that... Why would you stop us? You're, you're dead. Regardless. Yeah. No, you're getting out. Uh, death stance, just to give me a little bit more survivability. Spirit visage, more health. So heal and shield power is really, really good on Maui. Oh, bro, y'all really trying this? Holy moly, how long does that last? I feel like I was burning for 10 years. Oh, here it goes again. I need to get Sweeper. Already half health. I haven't even found anyone. That's fine. Just walk mid, keep him from taking mid. Oh, I need how much? So I'm currently getting 67 bonus attack damage, which that's a lot of attack damage. Kind of want to set up around this. If I can get a tentacle right here and bait him into it, that's really really good. Yeah, my my team is just gonna get shit on right here. Okay, I got one. Eh, we'll take it. Not even that great, I missed my E. So, I'll take it. I don't really know if I need this anymore. Does it sell for 280? What could I buy with it? Oh, if we get four infernal sold, four dragon infernal, that's really strong, actually. Yeah, I'll just wait to TP. Wait a little bit. You can TP uh, when you're nine gold from getting something because the time it takes to get that nine gold is the time it will I want to get a sweeper as well so at 91 I usually wait until two but 92 I can go ahead and TP if he stays down here I'm definitely TPing down there oh that's not good Oh, I got up Pike's Ignite and his Flash. Just sweep, just make sure they don't have any, uh, like that. I want to take their blue buff. I mean, that extra cooldown reduction. Right there is a good spot. Gets slammed from both tentacles. Should take all the jungle camps that I can. Walk down here. And then just keep on farming. 
I'm gonna back. Uh, I have 800 gold and I'm in like half health, so don't really want to be staying out here. Get this just for some more armor, just because AD, 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 AD. A lot of attack damage. I might get some magic resist just because of the Teemo, but as of right now, it should be alright. Oh my goodness, he's still nearly one. Oh, bro, you were way early on that. Sweet, so we honestly can just walk down mid, might be able to end the game. I'm very strong. Bro, just walk down mid. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm just gonna sit here now that they don't have uh, vision on me for a second. Because if I can get one of them to walk up into me, then I will kill them. Doesn't look like it, so go back around this way. I mean, I'm sitting at 360 AD. I'm building like bruiser items. This is giving me, oh, no, 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 this one, 73 bonus attack damage. Yeah, how's that feel, Teemo? Oh, it's always so nice to roll a Teemo. Alright, just keep on pushing. Just applying pressure. And missing cannons. And that minion. So the only way they really kill me is if they CC me. But if they don't, then I'm just gonna take objectives. Alright, this might honestly just be game right here. Goodbye. I see why this build is becoming very, very popular. Kind of a uh, nutty. But yeah, that's Alawi. Yeah. I was going to try and do a troll build as my last game for the day, but. It's always nice shitting on Garen and Teemos. <laughs> Alright, I'll give it to Diana. Die a few times early, let them think they have a lead, and then just start one-shotting everyone. That's how you play Alawi. 17 LP! Woo! That's nice. Let's take a look at this. Yep. Did more damage than a Teemo running the Andrews Demonic. Yeah. Uh, damage to turrets. Yep. Objectives. Yeah, that makes sense. Self mitigated. Okay, that's a lot. But yeah, uh, that's a Lowy. Uh, <laughs> three level lead. Uh, if you like it, like the video, subscribe. I stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash C98dub. Also on YouTube at C98dub. See ya.